Alrighty guys, it's Amit and welcome to DevDreamer. So in this video, it's just going to be a very quick one. I just wanted to very quickly talk to you about um, styling and CSS. So in the previous video and in other videos as well, you may have seen me use the style attribute on certain elements. So for example, in the previous video, we had our image. And when I originally put the image in, it looked something like this, okay, where the image was too big. And so I came into here and I did uh, style and then I had width 200 pixels and it minimized it down. You may also have seen me use it on paragraph elements as well. So we can do style. Um, let's just do font size and let's just say 50 pixels and it's increased the font size. So what is this that we're doing? Well, this is known as inline styling and basically it's just a quick fix. What we want to do is we really want to have all our styling on a separate file, um, a CSS file. Now we looked at that in the previous video where I created a, a CSS file called style.css um, and then we changed the background color of the uh, body, we changed it to red. What we want to be doing is all our styling really needs to go onto that external um, file sheet. Um, so let me show you how that's done very quickly to give this same effect. So let's just get rid of this and let's get rid of this as well. Okay. Um, and then what we want to do is in this folder here, we want to create a CSS file. So we looked at that in the previous video. Let's do it again quickly. So command N. Command S, let's save it as style.css. Remember, we need to save it as the same thing we link to in our index.html, which was style.css. So if you put styles.css, then this wouldn't work, okay? It should be style.css. Um, and let's just put those same styling attributes that we used um, on the paragraph in the image. So we go into here, and I'll just say P, do these um, curly braces, and then inside this, I just wanna say font size, uh, 50 pixels, okay, and as you can see it's been changed to 50 pixels, then I can do an image, select the image by doing img, which is basically the name of the tag, okay, um, space, curly braces, enter, and then I want to say uh, width, and it was 200 pixels, okay, so as you can see then guys, what we've got here is we've got the exact same styling done, but all our styling has been done on this separate file sheet, and that's how we want to do things, okay, but as I said, you may see me use it here and there in these videos. Um, you may just see me do inline styling just as a very quick fix rather than going into here. Um, and I don't know, I might just leave this up here and just use it here and there as well. Just so you can get used to CSS styling as well because inevitably that is going to be the thing you learn uh, next. So that's it for this video guys. As I said, just a very quick video just to explain what we're doing uh, with the styling there. Please subscribe and I'll see you on the next one.